New you can now listen to Fox News articles. Lin-Manuel Miranda, best known for his theatrical works, once promoted a group that assisted in bailing out of jail a man charged with the attempted murder of a mayoral candidate in Kentucky. Quintus Brown, who was arrested by police earlier this week after shooting at Louisville Democratic mayoral candidate Craig Greenberg in his campaign office using a 9mm Glock handgun, was released on bail after the Louisville Community Bail Fund collaborated with Black Lives Matter Louisville to pay Brown's $100,000 bail on Wednesday, according to WHAS 11. Amid nationwide protests following the police-involved death of George Floyd, Miranda, who has had theatrical and musical success with Hamilton, in the Heights and Tick, Tick. Boom, issued a 2020 tweet promoting the Louisville Community Bail Fund, calling on others who are heartsick to donate or volunteer. Donating adding the Louisville Community Bail Fund to the list below, Miranda wrote, attaching a link where donations could be made to the group. If you cannot donate, amplify, volunteer. If you are heartsick over racism and justice, let it manifest action, work towards justice, however you can manage, he added. God keep you safe. TV personality Padma Lakshmi, another individual who promoted the group and provided her followers with a link to where donations could be made to the bail fund, reportedly held a fundraiser in Sept. 2020 for then-Democratic vice presidential nominee Kamala Harris. Senate Minority Leader Mitch McConnell, R. Key. Criticized the Black Lives Matter Louisville chapter on Thursday, referring to Brown as a defund the police cheerleader. This far-left Black Lives Matter activist and defund the police cheerleader walked into a Jewish Democrat's campaign headquarters and opened fire, McConnell said, acknowledging that the situation is under investigation. But guess what, he's already been let out of jail. He's already been let out of jail, McConnell added. A left-wing bail fund partnered with BLM Louisville to bail him out. Less than 48 hours after this activist tried to literally murder a politician, the radical left bailed their comrade out of jail. McConnell also noted the hypocrisy in the arguments to release Brown, saying if he were a conservative then members of the media would be having a national conversation. I am confident that if activists claiming to be conservative tried to assassinate a politician, whatever his mental state, the media would open a 24-7 national conversation about rhetoric on the right, McConnell said. Fox News' Tyler Olson and Aisha Hasney contributed to this article.